Hello, and welcome to Japanese Craft Beer Reviews. Uh, from today, we're going to look at a, a series of four beers from a uh, rather small and fairly new craft beer brewery, which is called Heiwa Craft. And they're located in uh, a town called Kainan in Wakayama Prefecture. It is a small town uh, south of Wakayama City, which is the largest city in uh, Wakayama Prefecture. And they began brewing uh, in 2015. They're attached to a sake company, which started in uh, 1928 and uh, called Heiwa Shuzo. Shuzo is the common uh, name for a sake uh, brewery or a place that makes sake. So they started in 1928 and sake is primarily made during the colder months of the year and the brewers there started thinking they should take advantage of the rest of the year to brew and hit on the idea of a beer brewery and uh, now they have beer brewery i guess going all year round uh, on rate beer uh, this brewery has uh, 28 listings uh, 16 of them are for sake and 12 of them are for beers on untapped there are a total of 19 beers listed, and the average is pretty decent, 3.47 out of five, so pretty high. Um, so let's take a quick look at these four beers. Uh, I've had a couple of them before. Um, they didn't make much of an impression, uh, and I recently found four of their beers in bottles at a, uh, uh, a small uh, liquor shop attached to a department store. So we're going to look at four of those in turn. Again, Heiwa Craft from Kainan, Wakayama. All right, and now we have the second beer from Heiwa Craft and Heiwa Craft in uh, Wakayama Prefecture. And uh, there are not many, actually not many breweries down that area. Uh, there is uh, um, Nagisa, which has been around for a long time. Uh, and uh, more recently, uh, Gnome Craft. Uh, and I'm not sure if there are any others here. Uh, in any case, uh, this is uh, White Ale from Hewa Craft, and it is a 5% beer, and it is considered a wit. Uh, it's, uh, on rate beer, it's listed as Hewa Craft Session White. And this is a new, this is new, but I don't know if it's uh, uh, any different from that listing on rate beer. I, I think it's probably the same beer. It has five ratings, uh, an average of uh, 3.12, and on Untapped it has 108 ratings, and the average is 3.42, quite a bit higher. Yeah, I have had this before, but it's been a while, so let's give this a go. Again, Hewa Craft White Ale. Hewa Craft does not make a, a wide variety of beers, um, and we're going to look at four of them here. Okay, this has a very thin, pale, pale, pale pastel, sort of yellow, half a finger of mm, kind of fairly unimpressive head here, nothing much going on. Okay, to the light. Absolutely goes white, so you know this is fairly thin. Okay, very mild, mild, thin sort of uh, weediness. Uh, so it does have uh, barley malt and barley, unmalted barley, I guess, and coriander, orange peel, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and yuzu peel. Okay. All right, so they added their own little element with some yuzu. Uh, it has a kind of Definitely a sort of sweet, sweet citrus element. Like citrus blossoms, but kind of sugared over. Uh, and there's something unmistakably stinky behind it. And uh, perhaps that's the yuzu, uh, the zest, some kind of bitter, bitter zestiness coming up from the yuzu. I'm not sure.
thin weightiness, um, sort of mild artificial sweetness coming up in mid palette. Nah, I mean, it's a white, it's a white ale for sure, but uh, it's uh, not impressive in any way, shape, or form. The aroma, the aroma has this kind of strange, mild, sour, almost sewer, sewer like note. Coriander's very tiny. Uh, it's there, it's present, but uh, uh, nothing really presses here. It, it doesn't seem very well put together. Uh, it's kind of hard to separate out, separate out any of the elements. Um, uh, they don't really do much at all. Here, so this is, again, uh, from Hewa Craft in Wakayama. It's called Hewa Craft White Ale, 5% uh, with beer, uh, Belgian white. Um, uh, I don't recommend this one very highly, but you might want to give it a try if you happen to see it. Okay. All right. Well, let's take a look at a few more uh, Hewa Craft beers in our next few reviews. Uh, there will be four reviews in total from this brewery. Uh, so you can go check them out and I'll make a playlist. Take care.